everybody, welcome back. It's been a while since I made a video. I have been really super busy doing some stuff around the house, getting some things done maintenance-wise, painting, uh, a little work and some remodeling had to get done. Um, I still got a lot to do, but I'm back and I'm playing. I wanted to play an old video game called Bruce Lee that I used to play when I was a kid back in the mid-1980s. I was probably in my teen years. Well, I was in my teen years. What was I, 13, 14 years old probably? I love this game. Great game. Unlimited Lives? We better do Unlimited Lives. No, let's not do Unlimited Lives. Uh, opponents can't hit you? Yes, they can hit you. Um, I want them to be able to hit me. Okay, here we go. This is an old game um, originally on the Commodore 64 computer system. All right, here we go. This is Bruce Lee. I play Bruce Lee. And I gotta collect these lanterns and I gotta look out for these ninjas. Yeah, take that ninja. Yeah. And that big green dude is the Yamu. He is from the mountains. He lives in the mountains. And he is here to try to stop me as well. So the ninja... Oh, he fell. <laughs> the ninja and the green Yamu are not... Oops, did I miss something? No, I didn't. Are not here to help me. They are computer controlled and they are a major pain in the butt. But, saying but, I, hua, I can kick, I can punch, hua, 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 but I like to kick, so that does more power, hua, take that, hua, just like Bruce Lee. Sadly, Bruce Lee died the year I was born. I was born in 1973. And if I believe, if I remember correctly, that was the same year, year that Bruce Lee passed away. Incredible man. Just incredible man. Gotta have respect for Bruce Lee. So, we gotta collect these lanterns. Because that will help us advance to the next level of the game. Or the next uh, area of the game, I should say. This is an early platformer game. Haha, <laughs> fell on ya. As soon as I'm out of uh, visual range of those guys, they just stop moving. They don't bother me. I get to go about my go about my business here. Climbing, jumping, running, punching, kicking, doing cool Bruce Lee stuff. Now we're gonna go down here into the ground. The underworld or something. I don't know what it is. You gotta watch out for these little electrical things. Oh, and it killed me. Okay, not cool. Uh oh. Take that, yo. Take that, yo. Yeah. Uh oh. Ah, <laughs> didn't get me that time. Oh, oh, I just barely made it. I thought I was going to get hit by those little electrical things again. So this game you can play for free. Yeah. Um, all you need is a Commodore 64 emulator. If you have a PC, you can go online and do a search for Commodore 64 emulator. And once you do that, you just gotta pick an emulator. I think a lot of people use Vice. It's called Vice. And it's free to download. It's freeware. It was developed, whoa, thought I was gonna die there. Those little white things sticking down our spears. Anyway, go on the internet, do a search for Commodore 64 emulator, and then look for something called Vice. Download that, and you wanna install it. And then that is a Commodore 64 emulator. Now that's the computer that's being emulated that runs thousands and thousands and thousands of games that were out back in the 80s, early 80s, all through the 80s as a matter of fact. And most of them are freeware. 
meaning that you can, or abandonware, meaning that you can download them and play them, you know, load them onto your emulator. Whoa! Haha! -ha. Uh, load them onto your emulator and play them. Like I did with this one. I used to own this game um, back when I was a kid. Um, boy, that was a long time ago. <laughs> Do I have to jump down here? I don't remember. Yeah, I gotta jump over here. And then I gotta jump over there. Get that. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Huh? Huh? It's been a long time. It's been. 30 years since I played this? <laughs> oh, now that little thing reversed flow. Now it's coming at me. Oh! Oh! Hey, you! I made it! Yeah! Yeah! Alright. This is a fun game. This is a retro game. When people talk about retro computer gaming, they're talking about Bruce Lee. Or games like Bruce Lee. Games from the 80s, man. Like this one. I think this was 83 or 84. Something like that. This was a big game on the Commodore 64. A lot of people had this game. A lot of people had this game. Most of my friends that had Commodores when I was growing up had this game as well. Yeah, yeah. Just like that. Oh man. You know darn well it's gonna reverse, yeah. Okay. Well that's fine, that's probably easier. Oh it's gonna get me! <laughs> Jump! Yeah. I guess my hand eye coordination isn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be, but I haven't won the game yet, guys. I'm probably gonna get my butt kicked. Which isn't cool, man, because Bruce Lee doesn't lose, right? I used to watch his movies, too, all the time. All the time. I gotta fall down here. Now I gotta jump over there. Woohoo! What's my dog doing? Oh my gosh, he's making weird noises over there. Okay, let's go up here, grab this one. Go back down. These games were pretty easy. I mean, for the most part. Um, well, not all of the games. There's a lot of games that were actually kind of hard for the Commodore 64. But these games that they made back then usually took somewhere between 20 to 30 minutes. A lot of them. Like this, the early platform games. They took about 20 to 30 minutes, and you'd win them. You know, if you knew what to do. Once you knew what to do... You could win them in 20 and 30 minutes. There's, you know, back early on when I was playing this game, um, learning how to play this game. Oh, I'm going to kick this guy back into it. Oh! Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Um, when I was learning to play this game, it, you know, you got to figure it out, you know, and it took a little time sometimes to do. But once you knew what you were doing, uh, where you had to go, maybe 20, 30 minutes a game like this would be done. Oh, I fell. Oh. Run, run, run. <laughs> so, yeah. Good times. Yeah, like I was saying, just get yourself a Commodore 64 emulator. And then if you go to another web... Oops. Oh, no, I fell. If you go to another website called Lemon64... Um, you can see all the games. There's a game database on that website that shows all of the games, or darn near all of the games, that were available for the Commodore 64. And you can get kind of a preview of it. Hey, why are you mooing? Moo, moo. Okay, so this open. Ah! No, how come he's not hitting me? Oh no, did I hit the wrong... Did I hit the wrong thing when I was setting this up? I didn't give my... I, I died once, so I lost the life, but maybe I accidentally hit it so those guys can't... Or hit the controls so those guys can't hurt me. That, that's a bummer. I gotta wait for the path to appear, and then I can fall down here. Get these lanterns. And then go down this hole. Oh, oh. 
Whoa! Fireball! Okay, now I gotta go up here. Jump! Ooh, lay down. I don't think they can hurt me, but I'm not sure. Whoa! Boy, he doesn't... It's a little jittery sometimes. You gotta be careful. Okay. That opens up that wall. Oh, look out! I don't know if they can hurt me. I don't think they are able to for some reason. I think because when I originally set up the game to play it, I might have accidentally hit, hit it so that enemies can't hurt you. And that ain't good. I don't like to do that if I don't have to. Got an extra life. I think you get enough points or scores or something. Points, you get an extra life. Come on, run there, Bruce. Hiya. All right, now I gotta go up into these areas. Right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I remember. I remember. Oh, come on. Well, these guys spawn really fast on this level. Follow me! I'm gonna jump down on them. Can I go down this? No. Oh, I gotta fall all the way down. I can jump up these, right? Yeah, those are some kind of weird ladder. Alright, let's go down here. Ah, look out! Go in here. Go over here, go over here. Oh, there's a yin, a yin and yang. I got an extra life again. Oh, and then I just lost my extra life. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> oh, man. Not okay. Wait. Oh, wait, here we go. I am, like, so confused. <laughs> where I am, what I'm doing. Okay, what's in this one? Alright, I'm here. Oh, no! Oh, I thought I was gonna die. Okay, run! Why did I open up? No, get out! Ah! Okay, I gotta go way over there. Jump up there, Bruce. Jump, Bruce, jump! Yeah! Oh, okay. This is hard. I might die here, everybody, and not win the game, because I haven't played this, like I said, and it's been probably over 30 years, or 30 years right around there. Oh, okay. Jump, 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 jump! Oh, this is tough. This is not fun. Oh boy, you gotta watch the pattern and figure out how to go here. I'm gonna jump here. Oh no! Okay, I'm down there. Jump. No! Yep. I jumped just a little bit too late. This is where I'm gonna die. This is where I'm gonna die. That's just a bummer. Oh. oh, no. I was doing so good. Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Oh, that is so close. Okay, this one's a little easier. No, don't jump. Oh, I wanted to run. I'm going to die. I'm not going to be able to do this. Right here, I'm gonna die. Yep. This is it. Last life, guys. This is where I'm gonna die. We're not gonna be able to win the game because I I suck. Because I'm old. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I can do it. I can do it. I can't do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can't do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can't do it. Okay, this is the hard one because 
when you fall on this the one below you don't get a place to rest you have to time it just right you got to watch that pattern and kind of try to figure out what you're going to do here okay down over over mm, too late again that's it game over Bummer. I, I think I was pretty close to getting to the end. If I remember right, the end's not that far away. Fun game. Bruce Lee, Commodore 64. You, if you go out and you get yourself the emulator, a Commodore 64 emulator, they're free. Just do an internet search. Um, look for Vice. Maybe I'll, what I'll do down in the description of this video, I'll leave links on where you can go. And get the emulators because it's a free emulator it doesn't cost nothing to download just got to download it and open it like an app on your on your uh, computer but then you have to kind of learn how to load computer programs from back in the 80s on a commodore 64 so you might have to do a little research on the control functions and and uh, how the emulator works and things like that because it's a little bit different from what you're probably used to and then you just got to go and find the games. And the games are out there all over the place. Just got to do some searches and look for uh, Commodore 64 games. And you find a bunch of them. I'll leave a link down below for a place where you can go and look at a bunch of games and stuff too. Called Lemon 64. Anyway, it's been a while. I'm going to try to get back into doing some more uh, video uploads and stuff. Maybe not as frequently as it has been in the previous uh, months. But I'm going to try to do at least one a week and kind of keep this channel going. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope you're staying safe. Stay healthy. We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.